やで、ね、チェスなんか This is the Cathedral Peak Wine Estate. It's located in Drakensberg, about four hours' drive from Johannesburg in South Africa. Hi, guys, we are back again, Charlie. I hope you are doing well. Guys, as you can see, I'm doing amazing right here in South Africa, right here in Drakensberg. And, guys, I'm currently at the、um, Cathedral Wine Estate. This is how I look. Look. My dress is from Naki, guys. I'm looking so sweet here to have lunch and also to experience wine of South Africa. Guys, we are currently here, and the place is so beautiful. This is how the vineyard looks from here. It's so beautiful. This is how it looks like from outside. So, we're about to have lunch first. The food here ranges from 50 rand to 200 rand. The grapes are so nice. Guys, I'm sure you want to taste them. Here you go. Mmm. Mmm. It's so nice. It's so nice. It's so nice. It's so nice. Wow. This is how the vineyards here look like. They plant a specific variety of grapes here. The most common style of growing them is the vertical hedge row system. We are not having the wine tasting here. We are going to the next、um, location, which is also the same farms here. And this is how it looks like from here. So we are leaving here at the moment. The bus is like, it's already starting. One of the things South Africa is famous for is wine production. And I'm super happy to be experiencing this with you. So they found out it's normal corn, soya beans,、uh, grapes,、uh, there's some pecan nut trees and all of that. And then they started farming. So they left this area untouched because this is not a table grape, it's a wine grape. So the, the grapes that you buy in the shop, it's not the same.、Oh, okay. So a wine grape has more sugar than a normal table grape. That's why we can make wine out of it. Because the higher the sugar content, the higher the alcohol percentage goes.、Oh. So in 2006, they made the decision of let's start doing it. So they planted their first two hectares, Merlot and Pinotage, in the front.、Um, as soon as harvest season was here, they invited only family members because they weren't known for being wine estate or anything. Got the family members, they did it the old way to step on it. You guys can see there's one of the machines that they use. So you chuck all the grapes in there, you turn it, and it just presses all the grapes in between that one. So eventually, when、uh, they start to take the barreling, the bottling, and everything on the estate. So he's currently going to show us the first wine that was made. Down to the Cape and ask for help.、Um, the guy called them two cowboys for starting wine here. Who the hell would do wine in case it ain't? We're the first wine estate that has done it. So they went into the labeling, two cowboys. This is actually a red wine that turned the white. That's how bad the wine is.、Oh, so, wine this is wine. so this is vinegar flavor. Okay. This is not drinkable. This is just for display. It's like this is where we start. We learned 
the basic steps in wine tasting, which is to see, to twirl, to smell, to sip, and enjoy. This is the first we are going to try. Um, it says it's red wine, but it looks like um, Moscato, and it's it's not a sweet wine; it's a dry wine. Yes. <laughs> so I'm about to try it. Cheers, guys. Okay. Alright, he's teaching us how to rightly hold the wine glass. So he just taught us the right so way to hold the wine glass so like this. So for instance, now it's on the table, and I drink. need to lift it this way before I hold it like this. Right. He just said that if you want all the you want to feel all the flavor, the best way is to I'm sure people will be looking at you. No oh, so that you can feel the flavor, feel the taste, everything the wine has to offer. So. so all the wines have different flavors. When I tried this, it was more of dry. This was more of smoky. This, I can't seem to describe the, the taste of this, but this is what I like. And. I like the flavors because it's not too sweet, it's not too dry, it's in between, a honey hole you get. <laughs> so I'm going to try the last one. Hmm. The last one is the nicest. Guys, do you agree with me that the last one is sweet? Yeah. Yes. Yes. The last one is very tasty. Like and do you remember? <laughs> yeah, I'm loving okay. I'm a wine lover, so... Yeah. Oh, yeah, the right place. <laughs> okay, guys, so we just learned about wine, and he says the best way to hold it is like this. This is very interesting. It's my first time holding wine like this, and you you do it like this. Twirl it around, <laughs> just for the flavor to spread in the glass, then you smell it. If it's something you like, then you taste it. This allows all the flavors into the, every corner of the mouth. So doing all that, you cheers with your friend and enjoy. Let me know in the comment section, have you learned something today? I've also learned to hold it like this. So from now on, if you see me holding wine like this, I learned it in South Africa, okay? Okay guys, so we've learned so much about wine. Mabu, mabu. And I also learned that the people who own this wine farm have too much money. This is just for fun. Just they for don't fun. make money out yes. of this. They're just sharing so they're just sharing their, their hobby with the world. So when you come here, just know that um it's a rich man that owns this yeah. place. Sikedo. Yeah. Sikayede. Cheers. Nanka. <laughs> So guys, I ordered for prawns and this is how it looks. It comes with rice and uh, let's see what you get, Fimba. Okay. Whoa, looks, looks good. What did you also have? Ribs. Mm -hmm. What did you have? Salad. salad. Hey, healthy, healthy living. Akosa, what did you get? Chicken and prawns with yes. rice. Yes. And you? Mm. Oh, oh, yeah, yeah. So you're all invited. Guys, one of the things I've also learned is that this grapes that is grown here is much sweeter than the one in the supermarket. So I'm going to try it again. Hmm. Hmm. Guys, I literally have to steal. Mm. This is so good. Guys, this brings us to the end of this video. I hope you enjoyed watching this video as much as I enjoyed my time at this wine um, farm. Let me know in the comment section. Did you enjoy watching this video? Is there anything you know about wine making? Let me know in the comment section. Sharing is caring.
Please tell me it's nice. Where did you find oh, it? So good. This mm, of content it creation is, is yeah. called mm. oh. mm. so, nice. Yeah. Very. Me who be me kwati din. Guys, until next time on my next video. I love you all. This full experience was created by the South African Tourism Board and it's an experience I know you would love. Make it a point to visit this place whenever you're in South Africa. Since South Africa is now visa free for all Ghanaian passport holders, take the advantage to visit South Africa today and thank me later. Bye!